Hang on. Just chillax. Chillax, man. Alright. Are you ready? Alexis, are you ready? I am here. Yes. Right here in front of you. Right. Daddy, leave me up. Hang on. Now, come in. Two feet are in here. Hang on. What are you doing with your shoe? Right. G'day, my name's John Barry. Welcome to another video tutorial about Adobe Premiere Pro. This is version CS6, but this particular hint and tip you can use across any of the Adobe Premiere Pro versions. Now this Dad, is my... look how big your shoe is. Yeah, it's, it's a big shoe. Thank you. This is my daughter Lexi. I think this is kind of child's play, so I've got brought one of my own. So let's have a look here. I've got an edit, um, and, and I basically want to go in and fix up, tidy up, all these multi-track cuts and bring them down to one track. Now, I've seen a lot of people going out there doing this marquee select and drag down and it, it is painful. It's kind of annoying and it's not particularly accurate. Sometimes and it slips. I am... Daddy, stop. I need to talk. And I'm very cheeky because I'm a cheeky monkey jumping on the bed, on my mum's bed. Yes. So I'm going to show you the way that I do it, okay? It would be nice if there was a collapse edit to one track, um, perhaps even a collapse and edit to and two and tracks, Daddy. and you can set how many and tracks, but there isn't stop, such stop, a feature. Stop, stop. I'm trying to do something here, Lisa. Daddy, I'm trying. Hurry, people want to see what I'm showing them. You, you need to be quick. Okay. And I like ice cream so much because I love my mum's special ice cream and I know that I love ice cream. You love ice cream. I knew that. Oh, you're telling everybody out there. Okay, mm. righto. I think I've got a little performer here. Uh, so, this is, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to hit the A key. And it's going to change my tool uh, to the arrow select, like the um, track select. Are you right there? Really? Mm -hmm. Track select tool. With this tool, hey, with this tool, you can select and drag. So I can select that and drag it, select it, drag it, select it, drag it, select it, drag it. That's pretty quick. It didn't take too long. I'm done. Okay? Same thing with the audio here. And bada bing, bada bong. Now I'm just going to drag that up. And I'm done. Now, it'd be nice if there was a feature that did this all for you, but that's not too long. It didn't take very long to do. It's a pretty straightforward process. I've got, I've and if you've got one of these everybody. little I things, need to tell it's not going to. Just. Everybody likes to just. Just. Do everything, jumping on the bed, and just being a cheeky monkey. And I'm just that. I'm just very cheeky. Yes, you are. Thank you. Last thing I'm going to show is once you do have these empty tracks, you can right click anywhere in the naming of the tracks, go to delete tracks, tick the little box here to delete all and empty audio. video tracks and audio and hit OK and you've got yourself a very nice clean setup, cuts only. That's how to do it. That's how I do it. If you can find a better way, good on you. Otherwise, I have I to move on. Daddy, I know you were talking. I was talking with you and you were right, can you wrap, Can you wrap it up now? Okay. Everybody, you just wrap it up and then you just wrap your ice cream up. <laughs> this is Lexi Barry. I'm John Barry. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now.